are you doing? Hmm? I'm back. I'm facing an issue again. This PC is today crazy. Um, what it is is I have a Windows Security Action recommended. And when I press on that, I go and it opens a device security. Memory integrity is off. Your device may be vulnerable. Ooh. Go to settings and try to turn it on. It will ask for permission, scan, and then get off. Not allowing you to do stuff. So, let's see. Review incompatible drivers that are stopping my PC from turning this function on. And obviously it's way. Huawei? I, I don't know. So, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven drivers. Obviously, the first thing I did is search. Uh, 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 other removed programs. Sorry, it's on my other screen. Yeah, and obviously, I look for. The software I had for that telephone, mobile phone, I got rid of it by finding it, clicking on three dots and pressing on install, which you can do too. And usually this option is very good. Um, it get rid of everything, the, if not the most, you know, drivers and, and software um, that is installed on your PC. But not, not, not in this case, you can see there's still a lot left. So one would think that you can just go to device manager like this. Yeah. And look through those. Yeah. Let me make this a little bit bigger. Look through those and locate those that are stopping you. And people do that. And it's a very time consuming. This is a very simple reason because those devices are not signed. Like in here, I have my cooler. Yeah. In here, look, generic, 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 generic. My uh, printer. Yeah. Generic, generic, mass storage, root. Yeah. So it doesn't really give you. Yeah, storage controllers, you see, it doesn't really give you the full details that you need to make sure that what you actually uninstalling is what you what, what, what you actually need to uninstall. And if you want to get rid of anything else, you can just press the right key, uninstall device. Yeah. If you want to see what this is, you can press on properties details and you've got all the information here so you have hardware id compatible ids you can copy that paste it in google give a search and that will give you everything yeah you have the driver you've got you can disable driver an install driver update the driver as well and you've got direct driver details yeah but that's not what we want we don't want to search for stuff so much so let's get rid of this and let's go to google and search for something in it and that is driver store uh, explorer yeah. come on <laughs> There we are. And the first is going to be a link to GitHub. Yeah. I love this. You press on that and it takes you to this page. You can see that many contributors have been working on this and I would like to personally thank them all because it's a 
very good piece of work and I've got no brains to get this done so I appreciate yours now what you need to do you need to go to file no, you don't you need to download it and to download it you can go to releases yeah get yourself this pack it's packed with zip so you just click on that and it will download to your preferred location that you have preset if you open it it will come up like that right click extract all and extract boom it did it and it opened the already extracted folder as you can see this folder it already opened it let's close it yeah this is the folder and right here what you gotta do it's right click on this icon run as administrator confirm it and it's scanning the drivers give it a moment Voila, it completed the scan, and as you can see, it gives you a lot of information, including the file names. Because if you remember, we have the file names here, which is what we want. So if we look through the file names here and those files here, We'll be able to locate and get rid of the ones that we want. I believe there is, a, you can refresh it by the name, like, a re, sorry, you can sort it by the name, by the provider. Yeah. So let's do that. And there it is. There it is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we can just get rid of them. Ha ha. So let's do that. Let's click it. Take it. All that you want to get rid of. Because we don't need them. deletion delete drivers okay kaboom and it's removed what about that one and it's gone now let's minimize this let's go back go to settings and let's scan again There is one more, but all the others, can you see, are gone. So let's look for that one. This one escaped our attention somehow. Should we refresh? Yeah, let's refresh. Let's do this. FE here, and it's nowhere to be found. Which is kind of crazy. Anyway. Let's search for this driver. So this is. Let's go here to our system folder. C. Let's go there. Oh, I already searched for it. There we are. The search is done. As you can see, there is a lot of locations for this file. Let's mark them all and let's delete them. Oh, 
No items found, as you can see. Let's minimize this. Go back. Go to settings and scan again. And just like that, it's on. Liked what I did? Consider liking, at least subscribing, maybe. You know, I understand this is one-off thing that you were looking for to help uh, with the problem you faced. And I understand that. You don't have to subscribe, but a like would be nice. <laughs> what you can do as well here is select all drivers, old one. Yeah, and you can get rid of them. Yeah. Thank you. Stay safe.